NASA is celebrating this morning after a groundbreak, groundbreaking artificial intelligence helped discover a new planet. NASA researchers used advanced machine learning technology from Google to find the planet thousands of light years away, called Kepler 90i. Uh, it's in a solar system similar to ours. Michelle Miller explains how the new technology could impact the search for alien life and another habitable planet. Michelle, good morning. Ah, good morning. This is <laughs> super exciting for us space geeks out there because NASA researchers have known about this faraway solar system for some time, but it's how the discovery of this new planet was made that has the scientific community very optimistic. In the never-ending search for life beyond planet Earth, NASA scientists have uncovered the only other eight-planet solar system they know of that circles a sun. With help from Google and their machine learning computer software, scientists analyze thousands of data points captured from this NASA planet hunting space telescope, the Kepler. That data helped researchers discover this new planet, Kepler 90i. Having all this data coming from Kepler for scientists is like trying to drink from a fire hose. Astronomer Derek Pitt says it's the way the new planet was discovered that has scientists buzzing and makes their jobs easier. The Google AI system has been able to search through that pile of information much faster than humans have been able to dig through it. If you think about the analogy of the number of stars in a galaxy being like the number of sand grains on a beach, it's as if we've been asked to search through all the sand grains on the beach to find just the red sand grains. Like Earth, Kepler 90i is the third planet from its sun in an eight-planet system, but unlike Earth, the temperature on the surface of this planet is about 800 degrees Fahrenheit, which is far too hot for the possible development of life as we know it. It's about 2,500 light years away. That means even traveling at the speed of light, it would take us 2,500 years just to get there. Yeah, <laughs> current rocket <laughs> technology can't quite, you know, move in that direction. And it would take us millions of years just to reach Kepler 90i, as he said. The new planet also orbits its star about every 14 days, which means you'd have a birthday just about every two weeks, which I, I don't have a problem with. Would you? I Anyone? think I'm going to stay right here. But you're but, saying there's a chance, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, you know, there are other possibilities of hiding planets in that system. So you never know. They just yeah. found this one. But 800 degrees, that's a lot of sunscreen you got to wear <laughs> to block that yeah. out. I didn't know you were a science geek. I'm still thinking about that. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Yeah.